So with the Edison Lecture Series, it's actually okay with us if we don't teach the students anything deep and technical. Um, our goal is to really energize them about being scientists, about being engineers. What I want for them is to go back into their everyday worlds and to recognize where they see engineering and specifically electrical engineering. So I feel like outreach like this kind that the Edison Lecture Series achieves is really important because um, when we get students coming into to college, um, they have to know that they need to be prepared in math and science. And we have to teach them at a young age, both middle school and high school, that you know, math and science is important and that the things you can do with it aren't boring. They're very exciting. They're, and every year we have the solar car um, from our, our department. The students have built a solar car. Um, and the students that visit, the, the K-12 students, are really excited to kind of see and touch and talk to the students about that. Um, they're also very excited about the robotics um, demonstrations. We always have kind of a handful of robotics. And for the kids, that's really fun because they can really see something in action. They can see these robots moving around, climbing stairs. I've heard this year we've got some robots in there that are actually climbing up and down some stairs. Um, so that's pretty exciting for the students as well. In fact, just last week I had an email from a student who attended the lecture last year. Um, and he is now an, a freshman at the University of Texas and he was really excited about one of the exhibits he saw where a, a professor had actually converted his own car into an electric car um, and he wanted to get in contact with the professor so I put them in contact with each other. The student wants to make his own electric car and potentially do some research in the area.